Asus have a long history in this segment with their N-Series and later on the G-Series notebooks. The GL552VW is one of their latest launches at the time of this article, bundling a matte IPS display, a Skylake quad-core processor, dual-storage options and NVIDIA GTX 960M graphics. So at least on paper, it looks like a great buy, but and keep in mind this is a rather chunky and heavy machine, that's not an alt-printable. Design and Exterior First of all, you should know the GL552 is not a very portable or thin 15-incher, as it weighs about 2.57 kilos, or 5.7 pounds, and is about 34 millimeters thick, but at least it's fairly compact and especially shorter than most other notebooks in its class, as you can tell from the narrow bezel around the screen. Screen Asus chose a full HD IPS panel with the matte finishing for this laptop and I can hardly say anything bad about it. They replaced the Samsung panel used on the G551 with a better LG Philips one, and the numbers below talk for themselves. I'm using a Spider 4 sensor for my measurements and the Spider 4 Elite software package. Keyboard and Trackpad First of all, it inherits the same layout we've seen on Asus's mainstream 15 inches for a while, which unfortunately includes a cramped right side, with narrower directional keys and numpad section. There's also that power key in the top right corner, but I'm not even going to complain about it, since you'll get used to it after a while. Hardware, Performance and Upgrade Options Asus put the Skylake Core i7-6700HQ processor inside our test unit, paired with 16GB of DDR4 RAM, NVIDIA GTX 960M graphics and hybrid storage, with M.2 SATA SSD and a 2.5 inches HDD. The computer runs Windows 10 and the pre-installed software package is frugal, with an Office and McAfee trial, Dropbox and only a few other programs.